can't clear it, and he does, and that's going to do it for the first time ever. A team from the Maritimes have won the MasterCard Memorial Cup. Their mission is accomplished. And isn't that something neat to see? After the bitter disappointment of one year ago and a 9-1 loss to the Windsor Spitfires, Jacob Desaires in the middle of that mob as the young and gun St. John Sea Dogs capture the 2011 MasterCard Memorial Cup. And the heartbreak for Casey Sezikis, who lost that final of the World Junior. An overtime loss in the OHL final to Owen Sound in Game 7, and now this as the celebration will last for quite some time. Max Kitson, Chris D'Souza. These are scenes you see at the end of this game every year, and they don't get any easier to watch, my friend. And for that gentleman there as well, so much pressure put on him to win this game. And you go to the jubilation. Rob Falls has the winning coach. Rob? It has been quite a season for the St. John Sea Dogs with this young team. Well, they were everything. They did everything for you. Yeah, very proud of them, obviously. I mean, it's a tough game today, and you look over to the other side, and it's tough to lose, you know what I mean? So I feel for that team. They worked hard, and they competed real hard, and uh, it was a great season for the Sea Dogs. No and doubt. you really had to hold them off in the latter stages of that game. They came strong. Jacob deserved with the difference, there's no doubt. He played outstanding, and, you know, it's redemption for him after last year's blowout loss. Jordan, congratulations. Thanks very much. St. John's Sea Dogs are the winners of the 2011 MasterCard Memorial Cup, and this is the hardest way to say goodbye. Handshakes in your own building. The two-time CHL Coach of the Year has added a MasterCard Memorial Cup title. And Sam, when we left the rink this morning, the one thing I said to you after Jacob Desairs spent 20 minutes with us was, I don't care who wins this game, but after what I watched that young man go through in the final last year and how he's owned it and how great he's been, I just really deep down wanted him to play a good game and he played better than good and admittedly came in with a completely different mindset than a year ago he knew he was the number one guy he Gerard Gallant allowed him to bow to the last game of the round robin in order to get rested up and get prepared for this one and Desairs was fantastic full value the master card memorial cup champions the St. John Sea Dogs First time since 2006 that a Quebec League team has won the title and a maritime based team has never won before now. As we bring back our Hockey Central panel, guys. Peter Darmillard, Nick Kiprios, Doug McLean, and Damian Cox upstairs third level here at the Hershey Center for the second time in less than a month. St. Mike's watches the opposition celebrate and present it with a trophy on their ice and there's a wide-ranging thought process that Jacob Desairs was carried by St. John all year, that he was just there not to blow it. Much different tonight, Damien. Well, I'm, I mean, what a story, an individual story within a great team story. This is a young man, 21 years old, loses 9-1 in last year's Memorial Cup final. Then he's on waivers early this year, has to relocate from Brandon to St. John, and then comes in and plays. I mean, what a game he played. He had Chris D'Souza in the first uh, save off him. Devon, uh, Devontae smith Pelly late. What a game by him. General Manager Kelly McCrimmon from the Brandon Wheat Kings just sent a text saying, Jake's an excellent person, very focused, big on preparation, really, really happy for him. Yeah. Here's Rob Fultz. With Dave Cameron of the Mississauga St. Mike's Majors, you wanted your team to work. They worked as hard as you could get them to work, but still couldn't solve Jacob Desairs. Yeah. Yes. St. John's a great team. And you you gotta you gotta work hard, you gotta execute, you gotta get a few breaks. And uh, we didn't leave anything in the tank, and as disappointing as it is, um, when you don't leave anything in the tank. It makes the healing process a little slower. It doesn't take quite as long. As you say to your players,